Hey there, thank you so much for coming along and checking out this video. My name is Crystal. I am a former makeup artist, a big lover of makeup in general. I think makeup should be fun and makeup should be making you feel great. If it's not doing that, it's the wrong makeup. So I have a huge love of all things lips, which is why today we are going to be talking about the Westman Atelier Lip Suede product. I love clean makeup. And if you haven't used anything from Westman Atelier before, this brand is basically a luxury brand for people that want clean makeup, which is nice. It's nice to have that option. So the lip suedes I have only just recently begun using and I have fallen in love with them hard. <laughs> so the first one I kind of picked up by accident, I was popping into Mecca and it was literally one of those days where it was about to close in like 10 minutes time. So I was on a mission. There was one thing I went in there to get and as I picked that up, I turned around and a pop of red caught my eye. Can't go past red. <laughs> I was like, what is this? So I quickly tried on a little bit of the red lipstick that was in this adorable little palette and it blew my mind. It was just a gorgeous brick red color. So I had seen a sign sitting next to it and I was like, oh, okay, so it's like 50 something dollars. No worries. I'll grab that one. Um, not realizing that that was not the price. That was the price of something else that was sitting next to the lip suede from Westman Atelier. So I later realized that the product cost $130 Australian, which is, uh, pricey. And to be honest, I wouldn't have bought it if, <laughs> if I had been smart and realized that that was the price. So when I got it home, I considered not using it at all and just returning it. But... I decided to take a punt because I'm just lazy and I hate returning things. So I ended up with this baby, Westman Atelier. This is what it looks like. This is the Lay Rouge set. So it actually comes in two different types as standard, which is Lay Nude. That one has sheerer formulation. So I haven't used it myself, but I do know that the formulation is sheer. And of course it is for nudie sort of lip colors. This one here is the Le Rouge and it is a lovely little guy. Now it does actually come in a red velvet case as well, but me being me, lost it. I don't know where that is. It doesn't matter because I've got the inside and that's what counts. <laughs> so this is Le Rouge and it's already well loved. Yeah, I will also be posting uh, pictures so that you can see why these little things are called lip suedes. It's because when they come, the formula honestly looks like suede. <laughs> I don't know how they do it, but it's crazy. And then of course, once you dip into it, it just looks like normal lip colors. So the colors that you have in this particular palette, a beautiful fuchsia color up the top there. Then there is kind of a brick red color, which is the one I actually fell in love with hard, first of all. Then below that there is a tomato red, and on the bottom there is kind of a, I'd say a mauvey, brownie, dusty kind of color. It's quite hard to describe, and it's honestly not one that I would normally wear, but I have actually found it's really quite nice on the lips. So the cool thing about these is that you can either use your finger and dab it on as a stain, or you can use a lip brush if you wanna get a really solid saturated lip color. The reason that I fell in love with these so hard is because they don't bleed. I know, <laughs> it's miraculous. Yeah, they don't bleed, which blew my mind because pretty much everything bleeds on me and I don't really like true mattes as a rule. These ones are kind of a matte finish, but they're a, I would say they're a soft matte and they're not particularly drying on the lip either, which is nice. I would say love that they're clean because, you know, if I'm going to put something on my lips, I'm probably going to eat half of it. So <laughs> I like the fact that it's not laden with chemicals. And on that note, the Westman Atelier website do have a list of things that they don't include. Do in don't. Yes. <laughs> so they don't include in their products. So parabens, sulfates, PEGs, phthalates, which is uh, good to know. They've, there's been some research and papers coming out about phthalates lately that isn't very flattering. 
There are uh, no formaldehyde donors. There are no mineral oils, BH, BHA and BHT. There is no hydroquinone, no mercury and mercury compounds, no retinol, which I know a lot of people use in their skincare um, to try and combat fine lines, wrinkles and stuff like that. But it can really be inflammatory to sensitive skin. And these products are also gluten free. Plus, they don't test on cute little fluffy bunnies and animals in general. So that is also good news. So this baby here, the La Rouge Lip Suede, that one retails for 130 Australian dollars. You can pick it up at Mecca. Uh, they're also, they also have the Les Nude Lip Suede available. So you can grab that there as well, or you can get them from the Westman Atelier website. Now, one that you can't get from Mecca, is the limited edition Bordeaux lip suede. Now this one I ordered directly from the Westman website and I will say that the delivery time was epic. It was like so fast, I would say less than a week. And that is a nice change from <laughs> Pat McGrath. I ordered some Pat McGrath makeup oh, two months ago now. Still not here, haven't heard a word about it. So, you know, hopefully it's, coming. <laughs> That'll be great. <laughs> uh, in the meantime though, we do have these beautiful products to play with. So this is the Westman Atelier Bordeaux Lip Suede with the latest highlight stick as well. Now you can only purchase the Bordeaux in this kit. It is a gift pack. I don't know if it's going to be just around sort of for the Christmas period, which is why I grabbed it <laughs> because I love the formula of the lip suede so much that I just was like, well, I have to have these other colors. So this particular kit is called La Box, <laughs> which is, you know, what it is. Um, and again, this little guy, comes in the same kind of disc fashion and it is gorgeous. I will say that these are bloody hard to open <laughs> or maybe I'm just unco which you know probably but these really are a challenge to open sometimes because there's not really much of a like place to get your finger in there so you know if you can do it more power to you. They are worth the battle though. Battle on, my friends, soldier on. So in this particular palette, which is just as gorgeous as the other one, there is a beautiful poppy kind of pinky red up the top there. Then you've got a really nude color, like it is buff. And uh, normally I find I look terrible in nude colors. Like I just look dead dead like a zombie but <laughs> this one actually is great to wear if you're having kind of a no makeup day if you're just doing like a tinted moisturizer it it looks great it just makes your lips look polished and finished um but not like why you're wearing lipstick with no makeup you know which always looks weird so other than that you have a very deep kind of port color which is gorgeous and uh, is as delicious as port. And then down the bottom is the one I'm actually wearing at this present point, which is sort of a berry kind of color, mauvey berry color, which is very pretty as well. So that's what you get in the Bordeaux lip suede. Now you also do get this gorgeous uh, highlighting stick, which I haven't ever used before. Now, I think they're called lit up sticks. Clearly done my research. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these are called the Lit Up Highlight Sticks, and this one is in a shade called Parlor. Now, I have to say that ordinarily, I I would say my favorite highlights, the honor, goes to Becca Cosmetics with her opal liquid highlight. It is just a beautiful kind of pinky shade that's also like just really natural looking. It's gorgeous. And the other one that I love to use is the RMS the, I think it's the Living Luminizer. It's just clear. The reason that I didn't purchase the Westman Lit Up Sticks in the past is because the one that I tried on had kind of a blue undertone to it. It was quite a bluish translucent finish and I do not look good in cool colors. Oh no, my friends, they do not suit me. <laughs> so this one is beautiful though. I, um, it's, I would describe it as sort of a beautiful champagne-y color. You can see when it catches the light there, it's so gorgeous and luminous and light on the skin. So I definitely recommend this highlighter. I am getting a lot of good use for it. So if you are fair, this one will look 
beautiful on you. Highly, highly recommend. Now, as with the other lip suede, this one here does come with a little pouch. A little pouch. Like a little baby kangaroo. Um, this one I haven't even opened yet. So this is, a, this is a very exciting time. So a little envelope here. The old Westman Atelier envelope. Gosh, the packaging is lovely. It's so pretty. A little gold heart on the back. Oh, bless. All right, let's open this baby up. Let's crack her <laughs> so I can lose another pouch. That'll be great. <laughs> no, I won't. I promise. Oh, the highlighter stick comes with a little pouch also. So that is very cute. Oh, it's very blurry. There you go. Yes, adorable. And then this little guy too. There's a little pouch that they can live in, keep them safe and sound. <laughs> or like me, you'll lose them. So that's fine. Um, but yeah, so that is the adorable Bordeaux lip set. And that one cost $189.56 Australian, which is so much dough. I was lucky in that I had a discount code that I was able to utilize after I signed up to their registry. <laughs> Sounds like we're getting married. Uh, so yes, they are the beautiful lip suedes. I cannot recommend them more highly. If you are looking for clean lip products, I know they're expensive, but they wear so long on the lips. They really do. And they don't bleed. And that is just a miracle in my humble opinion. So definitely highly recommend the Westman Atelier lip suedes. If you've tried them, I'd love to know your thoughts. Just gorgeous. 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 Definitely get your hands on this. <laughs> now, I will be inserting some photos here of the swatches in uh, light, natural light, and also under ring light, light. It's a little light. Um, <laughs> so you'll be able to check the colors out properly and suss out if you think they'll be right for you. If there is anything else that you would like to know, if there's anything I've missed out, please feel free to get in touch. And I would love for you to subscribe to my channel and to, uh, you know, chuck us a like if you feel like it, if you're in the mood. And hopefully I will see you for the next video. There will be plenty of makeup videos. Also, if you are someone who suffers from endometriosis, if you are a fellow warrior, there are some endo specific, specific videos on this channel as well. Uh, it's something that I have been battling with for many years now. So please feel free to use those if you think that they could be beneficial to you. Have a great day. Check you later. <laughs>